Good morning, this is Quadcopter 101 and I have another neat review for you today. Uh, this Quadcopter is the FQ77954. This is a special quadcopter. And why is it special? This is the first nano quadcopter that not only includes a camera, but it also inclu includes a FPV capability. Um, it has Wi-Fi FPV built into it. The first nano quadcopter that I've seen uh, production quadcopter that includes FPV capability. Now, if you look at this quadcopter, you notice it has an SD card slot. That SD card slot is inactive on this quadcopter. There's no way of recording the video that you take with this directly onto a card on the quadcopter. Uh, the way that you, you record your video is via an app on your phone, on your smartphone. Additionally, this quadcopter can be controlled by your smartphone using its touchpad. Um, you can both view the FPV video and simultaneously control the quadcopter via your phone if you don't like the controller here. Um, you can control, there's two ways of controlling it uh, using uh, throttle and yaw and roll and pitch uh, uh, touch commands with, via your phone and your, your thumbs. <laughs> or or you can use the G sensor in your phone to control it by just tilting the phone, making it go right, left, and you, in effect, you only have yaw and throttle control. Now, this only works if your phone has a good touch screen. Unfortunately, my cheap Doogie phone here that I got from overseas does not have a very good touch screen, and every time I've tried to control this quadcopter, I, I, I lost control, I would lose control. Okay, the touch pad on this phone is just not sensitive enough to control this particular quadcopter. But if you have a better phone, such as an iPhone or a good Samsung, then yeah, you could probably control this particular quadcopter. If you notice the dust on my <laughs> blades here, that was from my attempts at trying to control it with my phone. But what I'm going to do today is I am going to fly this quadcopter using uh, the controller that comes with it, but I, at the same time, I am going to place my phone over here in the shade and put my sunscreen over it with a uh, HD camera pointed at this particular screen so that you can see the received Wi-Fi signal from the quadcopter. You'll at least be able to see that. Okay, so let's go into the flight of the FQ777. Let me get a thumbnail before we do that. The FQ-777-954 Wi-Fi FPV Flyer. Hope you enjoy this flight. <laughs> I don't know what that was, folks. But it... Let's try intermediate. Now I'm trying to fly at FPV. Well, trying to demonstrate what this quadcopter is seeing in FPV. Light up wind a bit. And again, you know, uh, with this particular quadcopter, if you want to use your phone to fly FPV with it, you are going to need to come up with a method to hook your phone. If you want to use this controller that I'm using, you're going to need to find a method to hook up your phone and be able to view it at the same time. I would recommend something like Google Cardboard. Um, to put your phone in and then you could probably make goggles that way. Let's try the flips Left flip Forward flip back flip so it flips. Let's go to we're an expert right now This is the uh and a drop out there and that's to be expected You're not going to get one back to beginner You're not going to get good range with this and why is that? <laughs> Think about it, folks. Wi-Fi operates on the same frequency as this controller, 2.4 gigahertz. So looking at this, we're about uh, 20, 30 meters away, about 20 meters away. That's about what to expect with this quadcopter, you know. Since it's operating on 2.4 gigahertz, the Wi-Fi, you are going to get drop outs if you try to fly too far. Now, where would this be fun? Flying around indoors, probably in your living room. And I think that's the intent of this particular quadcopter. It's not really for outdoors. Um, you wanna, this is an indoor FPV flyer. 
using probably using a good touchscreen phone for flying around indoors. Going to back to intermediate, going back to expert. I want to try to sh show the yaw rate on this. This is the yaw rated expert, beginner, intermediate, expert. Back to beginner. So in effect, an indoor flyer, although its yaw rate can be quite a bit when you set it to expert, this is beginner yaw rate still though. And I'm keeping it close folks. And the re main reason being, again, as I get out there, get a far away, the Wi-Fi starts, the transmitter on the Wi-Fi uh, camera there starts to become a problem. Okay, I still got, no, I'm running out of power for flipping. I just want to demonstrate it flying around. I hope that Wi-Fi is recording. <laughs> and I hope both my camera that's pointed at your Wi-Fi there, along with the phone itself, is recording. Keep in mind, I can also record the video onto the phone, and I'm doing that. I'm trying to do that. I hope it's coming out. I am going to fly over the receiver here. Make sure it's coming out. <laughs> Hello again. And again, I'm keeping it close. The main reason being the range on this is not going to be good because of the Wi-Fi. The way they do this is um, they lower the transmitting uh, Wi-Fi transmission uh, power. But, you know, that, that this works good close in. But as you get out there, that does still tend to be a problem with interfering with the controller. Let's see if I can get some altitude. Oh, there goes the lights. I'll fly it until it drops. Lights are flashing now. I'm going to stay over the grass now. So yeah, if you're expecting to fly this over your neighborhood and get Wi-Fi, FPV, it's, it's not going to happen with this quad. But if you want to fly your right in your living room and your kitchen, yeah, this will work. <laughs> so, again, this is the first Nano that I've seen with Wi-Fi F or with FPV capability. This is the, again, the FQ777-954 Wi-Fi FPV flyer. Hope you enjoyed this flight. This is Quadcopter 101, signing out.
dragon, mais t'es pas ta réalité contre la fatalité. Loser un jour, loser toujours. Oublie la dragon, mais t'es blague, laisse trouver la frime et tes jeux de mime retournent. J'ai dit merde. Oh, <laughs> oh,